why do guys find it so hard to talk about their feelings and actually talk and communicate? Do you know what? Because it, it is hard. One, like, I, I feel like it's a learnt skill that we are never taught. That like, if you're a boy who grows up with sisters, your sisters still get told, oh, come here and tell me how you're feeling. And you get told to stop crying. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, so boys you don't, don't cry. Yeah, you mm-hmm. don't learn those, those skills of like how to express what you're feeling. And like the, the acceptable expressions are anger and happiness. And so sometimes like there's really complex feelings that are like a mixture of like embarrassment and frustration and shyness or whatever, but it just comes out as anger. I don't know if you guys know, but like suicide is like the leading killer of men under yeah. the age of 49 now in the UK. Yeah. And my suspicion is that that's quite linked to like men not being able to express how they feel. Mm, it's, um, a lot, it's a lot definitely. higher than women. Right, yeah. Because we have a support network and we've been brought up yeah. knowing that we can talk about our problems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So I think if we can learn to talk about how we're feeling, it will just be better for everyone. It will be better for us, do you know what I mean? Like if we can learn to express ourselves, which is hard, it's not that easy. We do an activity in workshops where we're like, oh, sit in a circle and I just call it circle time. We go around and everybody has to give a word for how they're feeling and they can't say fine, good, calm, hungry, tired. And it's really hard like to actually check in with yourself and think about how you're feeling. I'd encourage you guys to just think about how you're feeling and learn the words for like to describe that feeling. Mm-hmm. And it's okay to seek help as well. Yeah. I think that's what guys struggle with a lot. It's like it's okay not to do it by yourself. Yeah, like yeah, you yeah. can support each other. You can help each other and like yeah. get help from like a therapist say. Yeah, we don't have to be a lone ranger. Exactly. Going, honestly, going to a therapist was one of, one of the best things that I've ever done. Mm-hmm. And it wasn't necessarily because like I had mad issues, do you know what I mean? It wasn't necessarily because I was feeling like I wanted to do something really bad to myself. Like it was just like, oh, I've got some stuff that I'm struggling to figure out. How mm-hmm. do I do that? Yeah. Maybe this person who's trained and is a professional can help. Using those services is a, always a good thing to do. And it can only benefit you to like access them and to, to, to help yourself be the better version of yourself. Yeah.